Hey guys, we are in Lollingston and we're gonna do a, a walk called Ainsford Castle Walk. So basically, it's like 45 or a 7 minute walk hike it's a loop and this will be our first time doing this walk here and yeah let's see what kind of scenery are we going to see mm -hmm. so what do you think Sam are you excited I mean I haven't researched about the place so my expectations are like I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you're not sure well let's see huh okay let's begin the walk so I chose this walk because it's fairly easy and it's quite late already so this walk is around 47 minute walk if you're unfit like me then it's a good easy walk so let's see how I get on but Sam is pretty strong I think she can make it and I'm already <sighs> let's see it okay So this is like an open build so far. I really need oh. You can actually bring your dog in here. But you know, I wanna go here for the first time and see if dogs are allowed. So at least next time we know what to do. I really need doing this hike so what do you feel so far a minute after <laughs> it's six think? minutes so far so far yeah so far. Oh, i'm tired already ah. are you uh, not really actually okay let's keep going okay let's do this ah. Ah. i would run but like i don't want to This reminds me of Philippines, all like rice field and stuff. Where is it, navigator? Where are we going? Straight? Yeah. Okay, cool. So, so far, just fields. And Sam is soldiering on. So after the field, you'll end up in here. Beautiful place. So now it's downhill. It's a nice walk at the moment because it's really fresh air. Look at the viaduct there. You can see it at the far. So this is a nice walk, right? But apparently my navigator, she made the wrong turn. What the hell? She made the wrong turn apparently, so we're gonna go back to the trail. Can't lose the trail, can we? Huh? Little girl! You made the wrong turn! Now she's running for the trail. Okay, let's see. So basically from that route, from the fields, you enter this uh, little path here. That's where she got lost. But now we're on the right track and she's already far from me. Okay. It looks hot but it's not really hot it's not like when you're in philippines when you see the sun you know it's hot here it's like you have the breeze it's not that humid so so good it's nice day for a walk actually i don't mind so we're passing a rail like it's a live rail so you have to beware stop look and listen hold on this is actually a live rail so 
Okay, let's go. Have to be careful here because we already saw two trains passing by. It's actually cool, huh? Field now where are we going now now we're surrounded by lush greenery here so you see I pick a short walk but it's too short actually it's like we're already almost there and uh, yeah, the highlight of the walk is actually this viaduct bridge here and yeah next time I'm gonna pick a longer walk because I think Sam can do it and it's quite an easy walk so next time we'll do a, a even bigger walk cool let's check the view out in this side So a while ago we were on the top, you know that rail tracks that we saw on the top? That's where the, actually the train goes on top here. Yeah, so we saw it from the top, now we're seeing it from the bottom. Cool, huh? I saw this car a while ago, I said to myself, let's just park here. Because this guy did certainly. So that's a private place there. Yeah, it's quiet here, huh? Okay. It's not a bad walk, but it's certainly a bit underwhelming. Why? Well, I think because it's a short walk and there's not a lot of things to see instead of the fields. So next time we do a, a bigger walk. It's not like as I expected it, so... guys that's our walk yeah i hope we're gonna do more walks soon because it's summer and the weather is nice so far and yeah by the way that's the castle there if you can see there's a castle and a garden there we were gonna go there well we did but it was close we just missed it we didn't what we missed it by a few minutes isn't it yeah it's close so yeah there we go this is Lullingstone, Ainsford Walk. But yeah, it's actually nice. If you like walking to the fields, very quiet, peaceful, you can bring your dog. Next time if we're doing a walk like this, we will bring Scotty. What do you recommend about this place? Um, nice walk, longer hike. peaceful, longer hike. What else do you think we could have made better? By the way, along this walk, there's also like some farms that you can go to, like this one. There's like a sanctuary a while ago that we saw, where they have like birds of prey, like adopted huskies and other animals. So there's like a farm that you can visit. And I think we also saw a camping place where you can camp, so you can also camp. Look, there's some people doing mountain biking here. Yeah, so we're heading back to the car park now. Maybe get something to eat later. That's a nice one. Yeah. That's actually private. They have their own private kind of like chill spot look. And it has like um, table, football, post goal and it's like they have their own lake there nice it's a very quiet place isn't it not a lot of like cars which is cool see this is where we started a while ago this is where the hike starts 
And if you want to go to the castle, you go to this road here. And the car park is just in behind this. Okay. We got hungry from the hike. And we found this place called Noi P Chef. Luckily, they're open. They have all this menu. It's actually in the middle of nowhere, which is surprising. But on Google, it has like 4.9 stars in review, which is amazing. And a lot of people said it's really good. Let's wait for the food, yeah. So Sam is already hungry. The owner of the place gave her some starters. How are you doing? I'm good, thank you. Good, good. it's uh, 27 pounds. Yeah, cool. Lovely. So, Sam, show us what we got, Sam. Open them one by one. First we got this. Oh. Not what I expected. That's a bow. That's a beef bow. Yeah. Yep. Looks nice. It's a bow there, you see? And this, these and the spring are rolls. spring rolls. Vegetable spring rolls. Cool. This is your adobo. And that's a salmon. Oh. Wow. This is beautiful, huh? And we're here, eating here. My daughter. Normally, Sam doesn't like to eat chicken, all that stuff in it. Always like eating fish, vegetables. She eats chicken, but not every time. But she took the chicken out of me a while ago. That's how hungry she is. And she said it's nice and crispy. It's like Jollibee style. So this is their bow. And it's, everything is tasty so far. Their bow. Mmm. Nice and soft. It's very soft. Oh, good. Let's try the thing. This is actually one of the best Filipino food that I tasted. That's a vegetable, right? Mm. It's really sick. Even the food portion. So everything in here. I think it's 27 pounds. Because he gave us free chicken. Gave us some free snack. What's that snack that he gave us? Corn crackers. Corn crackers. And he's a good guy. It's worth it. So this one guys is their pork belly adobo. See, it's another gem that we found. It's another hidden gem. Out of nowhere, this guy's shop, yeah, is in the gym. <laughs> and we don't even know if it's open. It's just a door there. And it was a gym, so here, yeah, Ron. That's the name of the guy, Ron. You got good flavors, bro. Me and my daughter likes it. How's your teriyaki? Mm. Good. The Noipi Chef, we recommend it. And the good thing is, is it got vegetables, even egg, salad, I mean that's vegetables, rice, meat, everything is there. That egg was so nice. The egg is soft, right? And the yolk, well like the white is kind of like jelly, you know? And the yolk is also soft. So, if you're hungry, you're around the area, and you like noise food, I'm telling you, go there. I'm, I'm not gonna ask you. Do you think you recommend it, yeah? Yeah, we recommend it. guys I'll let you know what we did today so basically it's like a failed hike I'm trying to like I know Sam already hiked before but I'm trying to like kind of ease her in to like do more hiking now especially it's a good weather so I try to give her like the easy kind of hike so basically this is what I did this like so this is the app that I use normally to look for trails it's called all trails and then you just type the area that you want to go and then explore that area and then see if there's some hikes or walks in there so i did the easy walk which is like a 45 minute loop and as you can see how it turned out i mean it's not bad she she told me that she had fun and at least we bonded and that's that's the most important thing and yeah hopefully we'll do more hikes yeah Cool. Okay guys, there you go. Hope we'll do more hikes soon. Um, so stay locked in and subscribed.